വെൽക്കം ടു എ ന്യൂ എപ്പിസോഡ് ഓഫ് ഗിർഹബ് കോ പൈലറ്റ് ആൻഡ് ടുഡേയ്സ് എപ്പിസോഡ് വി ആർ ലുക്കിംഗ് അറ്റ് കണ്ടൻറ്റ് എക്സ്ക്ലൂഷൻ ഫീച്ചർ ഓഫ് കോ പൈലറ്റ് ദിസ് ഫീച്ചർ ഈസ് റിലീസ് റീസെൻ്റ്ലി ആസ് എ പബ്ലിക് ബീറ്റർ ഫോർ ഗിർഹബ് കോ പൈലറ്റ് ഫോർ ബിസിനസ് യൂസേഴ്സ് കണ്ടൻറ്റ് എക്സ്ക്ലൂഷൻ മീൻസ് യു ക്യാൻ പ്രിവെൻറ്റ് സ്പെസിഫൈഡ് ഫയൽസ് ഫ്രം ബീയിങ് യൂസ്ഡ് ബൈ കോ പൈലറ്റ് ഫോർ ഗെറ്റിംഗ് കോൺടെക്സ്റ്റ് ഓർ ഗെറ്റിംഗ് ദ കോഡ് സജഷൻസ് you need to exclude some of the environment files or a file containing pi data or a token if you want to exclude a list of files from your repository level or organization level from copilot scanning you can list that files using various patterns so let us see how the content exclusion work i mean my repository you can set the settings at repository level or organization level in repository i am navigating to the settings under settings copilot you have the exclusion settings here so let me remove the current one so you have the example patterns provided if you have if you want to exclude all the env files the files end with an extension .env you can provide this way or the files under releases folder needs to be excluded so in, in our case i am using two different exclusions one is i have a pm collection folder under that all files needs to be excluded similarly under environments in my for system there is uh, ts files only ts files needs to be excluded so this is my settings one is all files under pm collection the second one is ts files under the environments directory so let us go to the code i'm i have opened the file the repository here so the first one is under environments the ts files so i am opening one of the ts file and trying to get the suggestion from copilot if you notice you have already this copilot symbol is blocked it is disabled so if you want to see the reason go to the output github copilot just try to invoke the or prompt the copilot by just a prompt or comma here it's disabled so you are not getting any information let me go to the next one in the environments itself there is a js file copilot supposed to work here and you can see the the copilot symbol turned to be enabled that indicate that copilot going to work for this particular one and the information is also there there is a copilot content exclusion it is not blocked reason is valid file so this file is not blocked so i can get the help from copilot i am going for a production environment the copilot start giving me suggestions in the environment if you prompt also if you start providing some kind of prompt also as it's disabled the copilot symbol you can see that it's disabled this will not work the information will be there in the output window as well it's a blocked kind of thing so that is how you can under the same folder one file or one kind of files the copilot enable the other kind of files copilot is not working so let us go to pm collection i have two files under that in pm collection we disabled the copilot for both the files any files under pm collection copilot is disabled so i am opening the collection.json you can observe that copilot disabled already the information came here it won't work here if i go and uh, try to give a prompt nothing it's a uh, copilot is not giving any suggestion same way js file still the copilot is in a disabled state if i prompt also define a function to validate email there is no suggestion or code suggestion coming from copilot saying that this content exclusion currently is uh, only for code completion if you open the chat and start working the copilot will start working for this files as well but the code the content exclusion is part of the code suggestions for example in pm collection i'm going to add a text file let us see is it going to up 
apply the same rule for the new files as well. So here also, if I start um, prompting something, still the copilot icon is disabled. So using this new feature of content exclusion, you will be able to exclude list of proprietary files, which may be holding your IP related code or the environment details, secrets or tokens, PI data. You can exclude all such files from an enterprise, sorry, organization level or a repository level. Thank you.